Welcome back to GTA Gamer. A few hours ago, a user by the name Luke Ross 00 has posted the latest script hook files on his GitHub page. The version is 1.0.1868.4, which is compatible with the present Epic Game version of GTA 5. As per the post, the script hook is running pretty well, without any FPS drops and errors. Let's check it out. You need to download the files from his post. The link is available in the description below. Extract the downloaded package. Go to bin. Copy both dinput 8.dll and script hook 5.dll to your game folder. The installation is now complete. I've tested the working of this script hook on different mods, and here are the results. All the popular trainers, like the Simple Trainer, Enhanced Native Trainer, and Menu Trainer, are working fine. No more infinite loading screens due to the Enhanced Native Trainer. Menu Trainer also does not crash anymore. You can even use all the three trainers simultaneously. Open IV Support. You can now use OpenIV and install any add-on vehicles in just a few clicks. Add-on vehicle spawner is working. You can spawn all the DLC vehicles and add-on vehicles easily. To test the stability of the mod, I've added 5 cars using the OpenIV package installer. Then I installed 6 more cars manually by editing the RPF files. They all worked fine. I have then spawned all the cars at once. At this point, the chances of game getting crashed are high. But the game stayed relatively stable. That too without the support of game config mod and heap adjuster mod. Coming to the scripts, I have added two simple scripts to the game. One is the blower script for the Dodge Charger car and the other is a fuel script mod. They worked fine. Add-on peds and superheroes can be added to the game and spawned using the add-on peds menu. Here comes the best part of the video. I have installed two graphic mods for the game. One is the Natural Vision Remastered plus Visual V. Played the game in different locations and at different times of the day. These graphic mods tend to cause FPS drops during nighttime. But the Natural Vision mod has worked pretty well. And the next graphic mod I used is the Redix mod. All the reshade presets that come included with this mod had worked fine. And finally the FPS test. Here is a side-by-side -side benchmark comparison. One without script hook. And the other with script hook DLL installed. The average FPS is the same for both of them. The person who updated the script hook 5 has done a very good job in the code. All the links used in this video and tutorials on how to use these mods are in the description below. Have fun with the mods. If this video helped you, hit that like button. You could also leave a comment to give some feedback about the video. Don't forget to subscribe to GTA Gamer. See you in the next video.